Welcome SRM Warriors. This year we are very excited to have you here, but we have a few changes and some of those things I'm going to go over in just a few moments in my video. But first, I wanted to tell you what a definition of a warrior is. A warrior is a person who is engaged in some struggle or conflict. Right now we are all warriors. We are all facing something new and we are all facing new challenges. My job as your principal is to make you feel safe and to make you aware of the rules and procedures that we have at SRM to make you ready for our school year. This year you will face many new things. You'll make new friends, there'll be new challenges, new opportunities. Choices that you make will define who you are. Please do the right thing, be a leader, be kind, and follow our school rules. I hope you have a great year. Please stop by the office anytime you need to see me or one of our counselors. I will see you soon. Welcome SRM Warriors to the 2021 school year. During this video, you will learn about safety protocols, your schedule, academic expectations, the attendance policy, use of technology, materials you will need for your classroom, the expectations in the cafeteria, who your teachers are, there will be a building map that we will go over, along with DASA regulations and New York State law. Requirements. All student temperatures will be screened before they enter the building daily. Any student who exhibits COVID symptoms will be sent home as a safety precaution. You must wear a mask at all times unless during lunch. It is highly recommended that students bring a spare mask to school and store it in their book bag. You must be six feet apart from anyone. Walk with your right shoulder closest to the wall as you walk down the hallway. Use hand sanitizer when entering each classroom and wash your hands thoroughly and frequently. Every student must wear a mask at all times, except when you are eating breakfast or lunch. If you are not wearing your mask, you will have three strikes until you are no longer able to come to school for in-person learning. Here is the three strike rule. First offense, student will receive a warning and the warning will be documented in school tool. The second offense, students must meet with the principal and will receive a phone call home. The third offense, students will only participate in virtual learning and will not be allowed to attend school in person. Classroom sanitation procedures. Students are required to wear a mask at all times. Students are asked to use hand sanitizer upon entering each classroom. Staff will clean desks upon completion of each class. Only one student is permitted to use the bathroom at a time. Staff members will be monitoring hallways to enforce this policy. Students are not permitted to use the water fountains. You may bring your own water bottles to class. No soft drinks or energy drinks will be permitted. Also, no glass bottles are allowed. Food allergies. Students who have food allergies, such as peanuts, pine nuts, etc., will have preferential seating in the cafeteria. Many classrooms are peanut-free zones. Your schedule is a hybrid model. Liverpool Central School District is using this hybrid schedule. Students in cohort A are attending school in person on Mondays and Thursdays. Students in cohort B are attending in-person instruction on Tuesdays and Fridays. Students in cohort C are attending school in person on Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. If you are a student who is completing everything virtually, you will be required to be online during the class times and check in with your teacher for attendance. Here is the block schedule. Here is the A-Day schedule. Notice Monday you are attending and Thursday you are attending. Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday you are virtual. The B-Day schedule, you are attending in person on Tuesday and Friday. Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday, you are virtual. Online learning is every day, every period, no exceptions. You must check in at the time that you see on the screen for every class. Academic expectations. Students will be held accountable for all assignments. Students' work will be graded 
and teachers will be expected to provide students with timely feedback. Grades will be posted in school tool, and regular progress reports and report cards will also be posted on school tool. Virtual students must log on and participate during their scheduled class times. Attendance policy. Schools are required to take daily attendance. Even for students who are learning virtually, you need to check in in order to be counted for attendance purposes. Students will be expected to attend each class in his or her daily schedule. When you are in a virtual meeting, you must have your camera on to be marked present. Students who fail to log on to a virtual class will be marked absent for that class. Technology use. All students are already enrolled in all of their Google Classrooms for the year. Students will use their Chromebooks every day and are required to bring them to school for in-person learning or bring them home for virtual learning. Make sure your Chromebook is charged every day. More information will be provided this week about other online platforms that students will learn to use this year. There is a zero tolerance policy for cell phones. Cell phones must be turned off and inside backpacks at all times. There will be no use of cell phones during the school day. See the student handbook for consequences for use of cell phones. Materials needed. Students will be asked to bring the required items needed for each class. Since all in-person classes are four blocks a day, students may bring backpacks to class with them to carry the essential materials for each class. There will be no use of lockers throughout the school day. Cafeteria expectations. Grab breakfast in the cafeteria in the morning and head to your first block class. Once you come to the cafeteria in the afternoon at lunchtime, please be seated and stay seated. Raise your hand if you need something. Throw away trash on the way out of the cafeteria. Your table will be dismissed by a teacher. No food is to be taken outside of the cafeteria at lunchtime. Wear your mask whenever you are not eating in the cafeteria. Tables are spaced six feet apart for your safety and you are asked to stay seated in the seat that you first sit at. What are core classes? What are encore classes? Core classes are the classes that you attend with the same students on your team, 7S, 7R, 8S, 8R. Core classes include math, science, ELA, social studies, technology for 20 weeks, and facts for 20 weeks. Encore classes are classes that you attend with any student in your grade. Encore classes include foreign language, physical education, music, band, chorus, orchestra, art, health, RTI, math, and reading, and the library. Your teams. Team 7S. Mrs. Lynch teaches math. Mrs. Rents teaches science. Mr. Morano teaches ELA. Mr. Good teaches social studies. Mr. Stein teaches technology. And Mrs. Miller teaches facts. 7R. Mrs. Corral teaches math. Mrs. Francis teaches science, Mrs. Meeker, ELA, Mr. Wentworth, social studies, Mr. Stein, technology, and Mrs. Miller, facts. Your 8S team, Mr. McDuff, math, Mrs. Schultz, science, Mrs. Stein, ELA, Ms. Ferens, social studies, Mr. Stark, technology, Mrs. Amioy, facts. Your 8R team, Mrs. Maslin, math, Mrs. Budelman, science, Mrs. Colabello, ELA, Mrs. Carroll, Social Studies, Mr. Stark, Technology, Mrs. Amioy, Facts. Your Encore Teachers, Mrs. Budman, The Library, Ms. Henson, Physical Education, Mr. Jackson, Physical Education, Mrs. McGrain, Spanish, Mr. Pratt, Spanish, Ms. Scone, Spanish, Mrs. Masenzio, French, Mr. Fasulo, Health, Mr. Hopkins, Chorus and Music, Ms. Cripps, Band, Dr. Vallo, Orchestra, Ms. Shire, Art, Mrs. Patra, Resource, Ms. Hunter, Resource, Mr. Wiegand, 15 to 1, Mr. Jackson, Special Education, Ms. Sabin, Special Education, Mrs. Valentine, Speech Pathologist, Ms. Candy, 15 to 1. Who's Who at SRMS? In the main office, Mrs. DiMaggio is the main office secretary, Mrs. Serio is the guidance secretary. Mrs. Kersey is the counselor for teams 7R and 8R. Ms. Serafin is the counselor for teams 7S and 8S. 
Mrs. Evangelista is the school nurse. Mr. Crowshire is in charge of technology. Mrs. Budman, the library. Mrs. Knoop, the school psychologist. Who's where at SRMS? Closing statements that are non-negotiable rules at SRM. Masks are required. Be respectful to students and staff. Follow staff directions, classroom rules, and procedures. No cell phones can be carried in your pocket. They must be in your backpack and turned off at all times. Dignity for all students. No student shall be subjected to harassment on school property or at a school function. No student will be harassed or treated differently based on race, color, weight, national origin, ethnic group, religion, religious practice, disability, sexual orientation, gender, including gender identity or expression. We are tolerant. We accept others for their differences. SRM has a zero tolerance policy for harassment and bullying. Consequences can include parent conference with a principal, detention, in-school suspension, suspension, or further removal from school. Where can I go for help and support? If you are struggling to meet the academic expectations of your teachers, find out when you can see them for extra help. If you are struggling socially, emotionally, please seek out your school counselor, Ms. Serafin or Ms. Kersey, at the main office or Mrs. Knoop in room 100. Do you have other questions? Please ask the teachers that you are in class with. Thank you so much, SRM. I'm looking forward to a great year with you.